Welcome to this tutorial brought to you by River City Graphics. This is the final tutorial in our series on the flash components and today I'll be demonstrating the UI scroll bar. So to get started we're going to create an ActionScript 3.0 document. Then I'm going to go to the text tool, drag out a dynamic text box. Then I'm going to go to window, components, and I'm going to drag out the UI scroll bar component. Now that I've done that I'm going to go to my selection tool grab the text box, go to properties, and then give it an instance name of my TXT. I'm also going to change the height to 370. Now that I've done that, I'm going to select the scroll bar, give it an instance name of scroll bar, and then I'm going to go to height and give it also a height of 370. So now that these are the same height, I can put this flush up against here and we won't have any overlap on the sides um, of the scroll bar, so it will be equal to the text box. So I'm just going to position that with my arrow keys. And the next big step that we need to do is right click on our text box and go down to scrollable and click. So what that's going to do is normally when you have a dynamic text box and you put in text that's going to go over the size that you want it, um, it's going to basically just keep going down it's going to resize the dynamic text box. And in this case we don't want that because we want it to be equal to the scroll bar so that it scrolls correctly. So that's why we right click and go down to scrollable. So basically what we need to do next is add some text in here. So I'm going to click inside with my text tool and I'm going to paste some text that I have. Um, and this is some lorem ispum text I used it in a previous tutorial. Basically uh, it's default text that you can use whenever you want to mock something up. So um, for this it works perfectly. So the next thing we need to do is go to our actions panel and we need to basically link this scroll bar with the text box. So we can say scroll bar dot scroll target then a space equals space and then my txt semicolon. So we're basically saying the target of the scroll bar is my txt which is the instance name of this text box. So I'm going to close that up, go to control test movie and everything seems to be working okay. We're scrolling. This is the exact same size as the text box, and it's a pretty nice component. So I hope you guys learned something about this uh, component. Uh, it's pretty nice if you wanted to do something other than the scroll pane or any other method in Flash for scrolling. I um, hope you guys subscribe, rate, and comment. Uh, and if you have been following along with this series and you have a favorite component, uh, please leave a comment below saying what your favorite component was and uh, I guess why it was your favorite component. Um, so. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.